and I'm the Social Justice Chair of the Northwoods Unitarian Universalist Fellowship. Our, wel our, our fellowship welcomes all of you. This is just an awesome uh, turnout and um, first time in Rhino Lair. So. Uh, we had um, Leisha Brooks was here in Rhino Lair at college too. So. Um, this is our annual, uh, 11th annual speaker event in honor of Martin Luther King Jr. And it is the only one in the uh, entire northern part of Wisconsin, so um, we're very proud of that. We're proud of the co-sponsors that have been with us for about three years now, and with the co-sponsorship comes other benefits of just kind of knowing what everybody's doing. So uh, we thank Father Anderson and Jackie Cody and the members of the St. Augustine's uh, Episcopal Church for allowing us to use this beautiful space. And I didn't even know about the dancing or the pool hall. And uh, they're offering to set up and clean up, which is amazing because we have another show, uh, you know, the, we're the traveling show today, so we'll be doing some more shows again tonight. So traditionally, we've only had the evening event, and by providing a daytime option, we're hoping, I, I think that we've already decided that this is worthy to have it here because it's really hard on a January night to come up to move us. So we've uh, Sometimes we've taxed our, all of our Rhinelander friends to coming up and, and um, appreciate the support, but I'm always a lot more comfortable having them here and not having to worry about them on the road. So, um, For the first eight years, we, we hosted the event alone. Three years ago, a few co-sponsors joined us, including St. Augustine's. And now it, it's, it's grown to be St. Augustine's, uh, St. Francis Project of St. Matthias Church in Manaqua, Many Ways of Peace in Eagle River, League of Women Voters of the Northwoods, American Association of University Women Rhinelander, Northwoods Branch, the Congregational United Church of Christ in Rhinelander, and North Central Labor Coalition. So we, we really have grown quite a bit and I'm very proud of that and we're going to get bigger all the time. We might have to start our own building or something. It's uh, truly a pleasure working with such dedicated organizations. They 